So what's up guys, how are you guys doing? Uh, good morning, good afternoon, good evening, depending on where you guys are watching this video from. I hope you guys are very much doing okay. Firstly, uh, I know I'm not supposed to be addressing this issue here because this particular matter, I didn't post the video here. I posted it on Adam's link, but this is another separate channel. We were discussing about uh, the Twee Twee Kiss Daniel's uh, song, featuring uh, David the remix. And obviously I said, I am not feeling that song. People just think I do not like the video. Come on. I know, guys, for those of you who have been watching me for a long time, you guys have accused me several times that I carried the video on top of my head. You guys once said I do not like whiskey. You guys once said I do not like Bonner Boy. You guys also said I do not like the video. So, for those of you watching me for a long time, you know I do not support anybody. I just speak my mind. I don't like that 2020 song. That doesn't make it bad, though. It's good. And I know the song will blow. But for me, I don't like him. Papa, people should be able to accept other people's decisions, like critics. People say, no, Adam Slink, you are not supposed to be on any kind of criticism or anything at all. You are just a vlogger, a blogger, who just will just report the news and let other people decide. Who told you I'm that kind of person? I'm a human being to have my own opinion on many things now. That is why I'm doing this stuff. My own opinion. You share your own opinion and I will respect yours. If you can convince me, okay, good and fine. If I can convince you, okay, you should be able to accept it now. Abba, let me rest now. Charm man. But I love you guys though. You know, it's just for the fun and uh, we enjoy each other. Compliments. So meanwhile, let's talk about very dark man, Mr. Ibo. Very dark man is on will be Franklin case. Meanwhile, Mr. Ebu arrested his uh, uh, adopted daughter Jasmine and his son. Guess how much these people siphoned? 55 million naira from Mr. Ebu. Also traced to very dark man. But very dark man, I be the support Jasmine passed at that time. And many of us also supported Jasmine. We, we were bashing the wife. Well, we, we're going to address that, but let's know the issue between very dark man, Ubi Franklin, that has to affect uh, Davido again. Davido again, no. Davido just didn't make news. <laughs> again, no. Apparently, Ubi Franklin is siphoning money, duping people of their money using the name of Davido. That is just what this whole entire story that I want to talk about is about. Everything about the whole entire story is about will be, will be frankly duping people using David's name. And just have a hope on my there. Let us listen to the video. Hmm? I'm going to play it. And as you watch, try as much as possible to leave your comment. And then I will also give my own opinion as well. Right. So, Ubi Franklin, you are supposed to be a senior man in this entertainment industry, but as of now, you are a thief. And what do they do to thieves? They expose thieves so that other people will not become victims. Ubi Franklin, you are a thief. Now, this is the details of your own account. First transaction, 5 million naira is here to offer Ubi a katong. Another one again is here of 2 million. To a firm or firm will be a cat long, another one again here yeah, to a firm, another one of 2.5 to a firm will be a cat long, and the last one of 1 million to a firm will be a cat long. Everything together is 10.5 million naira. Now, how did you get this money? It's so embarrassing. It is really embarrassing that um, you people go and use David's name to extort people. You understand? You're collecting money from somebody that, and you are telling you tell the, somebody wants to feature the video. You are collecting money on behalf of the video. Are you the video's manager? You understand? And that's how a lot of you have been able to take advantage of the video. Now let me tell you guys what happened. This particular guy sent Ubi a message and said, "Okay, Ubi, I'm looking for a way to push my artist." You understand? Ubi said, "Hey, if you want me to know that you are serious, send me two million now. Now that one sent two million. Oh yeah, Alpha, we have money for promotion. Let's promote this guy." Ubi said no, that they should feature one big artist. You understand? That they should feature one listener. The guy now said, okay, they have plans to feature the video. 
that people are telling them that Davido used to charge plenty money. We'll be saying, ah, don't worry, don't worry, don't worry. We'll, I'll get you the video for 5 million naira. The boy sent 5 million naira. You understand? When he sent 5 million naira now, jack, 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 jack. The boy sent uh, 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 5 million. Now, when it was time to feature the video, they'll call Ubi. Ubi go do video around the video house. He go tell them, say, I am here now. I am with David. You understand? All I need to do is to just follow him and talk. He's busy now. We'll call you. This, that. Finally, see another scam where Ubi do. Ubi now told them that if they want to follow the video and talk, that they have to go on tour with the video. That is going to do visa for them, US visa. The guy said, okay, my artists don't need visa. We'll contact you. I will contact my co-owner of my label. Then that one can go to the US because he wants to go to the US. Ubi said, okay, I'm going to put him, put him a slot under the video. They send, but they send money to Ubi. Ubi, are you United States consulate? Are you close to the ambassador? What I know is that nobody can give anybody US visa or any other visa anywhere. You understand? You are not just, you know where you be right now as we talk. So you are obtaining under false pretense. You understand? You are a thief. And you know why I did not have any reason to doubt what the guy told me? It is because I had a mutual friend. I was sitting down with my mutual friend one day in 1004 estates that time. Somebody called that the guy that my friend then should help him beg you that you should send him one million because he borrowed money from his hand. I did not pay. So your story don't already they say now which you they do. And now you don't they use the video name. I am pretty sure you cannot get the video to do a feature with five million naira. And I'm pretty sure this is how you have been extorting people, collecting money from everywhere with the name of David. Not just you. A lot of people around that David. Now, now they put that boy left for front. Now, now they spoil. Now, now be the same people that are saying that they spoil his name. So the boy give you money, finish. You cannot go meet Yanya. Is Yanya David? Eh? Does Kukere sound like femme? Does Kukere sound like femme? Well, bros, me and you, eh? Me and Abuja, I know you have your connection, you know one or two people, but I swear to God, yeah, me and we frustrate you. You go pay that money. First thing when I'll do tomorrow, all of us know I say for Abuja, don't worry, your connection, hold on. I'll pay Karan go with TFCC first. I'll file a petition against you, obtaining under false pretense. 10.5 million naira is not 10 naira. We'll be frankly, you are a thief. I said what I said, you are a thief. Obtaining Nigerians under false pretense is stealing. He's stealing, and I'm pretty sure you are not Davido's manager. And I'm pretty sure Davido did not give you a go ahead to collect money on his behalf. You know, even data TBG. Now, the reason for this video is simple. So, all those people where they carry money, they give all those Davido, then people say, okay, you want to go feature David. After you go say that David, collect your money for your hand. You better be careful. And to every other person that give money, you cannot contact the artist. You carry money, go they give all those people. I know who know who. You know, another problem with you Nigerians is you people like soft landing. You like soft landing. So another reason is because I don't want anybody to give Ubi Franklin money. I don't hear Ubi Franklin story plenty. Say na in way. Now why I don't even need to ask Sam? I know say into him. Ubi. Me, I'm giving you two days. If you don't give him. So guys, uh, I don't know what happened. But apparently, it's not even apparently. Sorry for using that word apparently all the time. The fact is, very dark man said, will be frankly will be arrested very very soon will be frankly going around using davido's name to collect money going around using davido's name to collect money and vdm is quite close to davido maybe has already messaged davido and davido has responded maybe something like that so be frankly now i'll find out but we already know that most people around Davido use Davido's name just to see job money as well. No be only about frankly. You remember that uh, uh, Hosseini Salami matter? You guys remember now, you recall. How Hosseini Salami narrated everything. How he went through uh, Big Speck, Davido friend, who they said he should bring something but a, a, a special never really got anything from him. How he went through his Davido sister, you know. They see they chop around Davido as well. Why you will collect person five million naira? They beg, they 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 give the person who say go fee feature Davido. So we think they are poor now. I be that five five million naira now for reference. Now for reference. See, I'm not saying eh. 
will be far frank to anybody close to David who cannot chop up. But why not do it like this? If you have a good song that is popular, okay, I'm going to talk to David O. David O might charge very high fee, but me, for referral fee, this one are my money. If you make it clear to that person, then I don't think there's anything wrong with that. Reference fee, you tell it on my money, that five million they collect for reference fee. How, how you go, how person, you, the person say me the scam, the guy that I'm on, person say if he get you to be featured, with, uh, to, to get you a feature from David Do. David Do to drop on your track for five million naira. I also look David Do. I also look David Do now. Well, will be. Well, that very dark man talk amo. You know, say very dark man by time I talk something. Some of the truth, the, some of the things do come out to be true. You know, that is how very dark man also eh? talked about uh, Mr. Ibu. How very dark man supported uh, uh, Jasmine and uh, Mr. Ibu's son and blasted the wife, not knowing that it seems like that uh, Jasmine and the other guy that they siphoned money, the sum of more than 50 million naira. Now, this girl and this guy don't siphon. So now, if all those things have been revealed, I want to know one thing before I start reading what they exposed. Did Mr. Hippo actually slept with his adopted daughter? And is Jasmine now dating Mr. Hippo for son? Appa! <laughs> they do they share you for inside one family? Appa! Well, let me read you the update. It's coming from Mr. Blog. They said, through the, through this fraud, okay, they said police arrest, uh, actor John O'Carver's son and adopted daughter for, for 55 million naira for pillaring 55 million naira from his donation. Through this fraudulent act, uh, Daniel O'Carver, that is, uh, uh, Mr. Ebuson and Jasmine Choma started transferring fraud from Mr. Ebu's public. Okay, okay, okay. Let me start from the beginning. Sorry, guys. I just I just started it somewhere, not from the beginning. They say MCID spokesperson ASP Aminat in the statement said on the 6th September 2023, a petition was received from Diamond Wavy's Law on behalf of Stella. Maris Okafor, wherein one uh, Daniel Okafor and Valentine Okafor, both of them are son of Mr. John Okafor and Jasmine Choma, we are allegedly to have conspired to defraud Mr. Ibu while being on sickbed. The investigation into the case established that as part of the effort to fund this medical bill, Mr. Ibu launched a public fund raising initiative and attracted donations from the fans, entertainment industry players and other well-spirited members of the public, public, uh, members of the public into the bank account, which he publicized and dedicated for the purpose. Mr. Abel's wife, Stella, was initially managing the fund to defray the, the medical bills of Mr. Abel and sustain the family. However, Along the line, the dua uh, of uh, Daniel and Jasmine Choma and manipulated Ms. Mrs. Stella Maris took possession of Mr. Ibu's phone and act into the banking details. The day after, we installed the mobile banking application of Mr. Ibu on the phone of uh, Daniel Okafo to be the perfection of their fraud, fraudulent plans, I wiped off the bank application originally installed by Mr. Ibu's phone, thereby taking direct and full charge of bank activities of Mr. Ibu in relation to the fund being donated by members of the public in support of his medical bills. Through this fraudulent ad, uh, Daniel and uh, Jasmine started transferring from, from Mr. Ibu public uh, account to Daniel personal account with forensic analysis of their illicit financial dealings, establishing that a total of 55 million naira has been 
successfully and criminally transfer prior to their arrest and investigation. Investigation also on head text message via WhatsApp between Jasmine and Daniel detailing in stage by stage how they conspire and achieve their criminal plans. It was also established that the two suspects, Jasmine and Daniel, had a sham marriage. Sham marriage at the Kohim marriage, uh, marriage registry with, with plans to escape from the country to UK where they, where they intended to settle with their proceed of crime. They already appeared for a UK, applied for a UK visa, a visa. Okay. During the investigation, the stolen 55 million naira was traced to the bank account of uh, Daniel Carrefour, wherein it was discovered that they had squandered a total of 5 million naira on questionable transaction, while the balance of a uh, total of 50 million naira has been recovered from him. On the strength of evidence, Daniel and Jasmine have been charged to the Chief Magistrate Court for conspiracy and stealing. They are granted being in the sum of 15 million naira to short in the, in the like sum why case was adjourned to 11th March 2024. Meanwhile, this, the case file has been forwarded to the office of the director of uh, the public prosecutor for legal advice. See, I see talking before, eh, and I will talk up again. Hmm? Mr. Iboe, that yeah, yeah, man. Honestly speaking. Now they have recovered the money. Why are you allowing your wife to pursue with the court case? You want me to send your son go jail? Then go make you happy for people donation. Make your son one cock siphon. Now they have recovered fifty million naira. Why don't you let them go? You are the one that also stated that all your transaction should be handled by your son. I think it's the second son there about now. Yes, the second son. Well, uh, but yet again, eh, sorry, I may not be wrong with, with, with my first statement, but yet again, eh, if Jasmine and that boy really cared about Mr. Abel's life, if somebody's stealing for you, stealing from you, why on that sick bed, eh, you are struggling with your life? That means that person is willing to see you die. Mm? I know it's painful for Mr. Abel. That person is willing to see you die. But this is where your, you as a father, this is how Mr. Abu need to think critically. He need to think critically very, very well. Because the issue deep, really, really deep. Honestly, you know what? I'm just going to reserve my comment here. Eh? Let me think about this whole matter very, very well. Eh? In my next video, I'm going to really address it. Because I don't know why this is a really deep family issue. It has to do with love and also... Uh, dealing with people who, who defrauded you. So I'm going to really think about it and then get back to you guys.